everyone, so I just wanted to do a kind of random video. Uh, first I want to do a shout out and then I'm going to show you guys a couple of things that I got for Christmas for my boyfriend. Um, I kind of fail at making videos most of the time and I wanted to kind of show things as I was getting them, kind of just as like ideas for guys. However, I wrapped most of them, so that's really not very helpful for anyone. But um, <laughs> I'm thinking maybe after Christmas, I highly doubt I'm going to be able to um, convince him to do like a Christmas vlog type deal as far as like, you know, what I got for Christmas because he doesn't like being on camera. He has his own YouTube channel, however, it's mainly like videos of his motorcycle and when he goes to car shows and stuff like that because um, he doesn't like really like being on camera so I don't know if I'll be able to get a video out of him but if I do then I can show you guys then however I want to start out with a shout out to a um, subscriber here on YouTube um, I don't know exactly when she subscribed to me she might be a long time subscriber and I'm just not realizing it um, but she did my uh, my last video that I made doing the uh, like questions that I would ask tag, um, she's the only person I know of who actually did it, so I think that's so awesome. Uh, she's incredibly funny. She's got two videos up right now, um, but I want her to do more. So Joyce, if you are watching this, please make more videos. Um, her username is Joyce Hosterman. Hosterman, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, you'll have to let me know how to pronounce it. Um, but I'm going to leave you guys a link to her channel so you can subscribe to her and tell her to make more videos because she only has two up right now. I think she just maybe started making them the other day because I kind of stalked her a little bit and I saw that um, her first video she made a day ago. So anyway, subscribe to her and tell her to make more videos. So I just want to thank you, first of all, for doing the uh, answering my questions tag and also thank you for subscribing to me so I hope you guys like this video I'm gonna show you a couple of things that I got my boyfriend for Christmas he's downstairs playing I think Call of Duty right now so uh, something's off the top of my head mostly I got him a lot of clothes this year because he's been really into um, he goes to the gym like every day because he's really into like getting buff which I mean I'm perfectly okay with so I wish I had that kind of determination I don't um so while he is like getting all like nice and fit I'm like packing on the pounds so that's not a good thing but um anyway so I got him um a couple different uh clothes since he's um his clothes are getting a little too tight so um got him some clothes, I got him shoes, I got him, oh shit, what all did I get him? I got him some like bodybuilding type things that he asked for to take to along with him to the gym when he goes because he, he like lifts weights and everything and I got him that bandana, I think I, I think I hauled that, I think I hauled a couple of the tops that I got him. Mm, oh, I got him a play a PlayStation I for his uh, PS4. Um, I knew he really wanted that, and I can't remember everything. But I'm gonna show you some of the things that I got today. Uh, okay, <laughs> the first thing I got I got these uh, socks at Ross, and these are by Converse, and you get six pairs, and they're all different colors. You know, there's like blue. Uh, a royal blue, a yellow, an orange, a red, and a gray and white. Um, he likes collared socks, and um, I, I know socks may be really lame to people, and maybe like you guys like, who wants socks for Christmas? We're weird, and we like socks, so I know he'll love these. Um, these were eight dollars, so I thought that was a pretty good deal for uh, six pairs of socks, um, especially Converse. They're really nice, thick um, material, and the um, you know they're the moisture wicking ones, so he can wear them to the gym, and you know it's just kind of perfect. So while I was putting laundry away um, the past a uh, couple of days, I noticed like a lot of his socks are getting holes in the heels, so I know that he really needs them. 
Then at Ulta, I got him this uh, Jack Black lip balm. This is a, a man's lip balm. They had all different flavors, but I got the Shea Butter because I thought that was like the the least girly because I know he doesn't want to use lip balm because it's it's girly and he's definitely like a manly kind of guy. He don't like pussified shit and I know he isn't going to want to use this, but when he plays his video games, he's like a little boy and like he'll sit there and he'll like have his tongue sticking out like like that and like his lips will get really dry and he's like every every time he's like done playing games, he's like, "Oh, my lips are dry." So, I got him lip balm and he uses the Jack Black brand, like the beard lube and stuff on his face, so I know he loves this brand. So um, I think maybe he won't have such a problem with it because it's Jack Black. Because I know if I would have gotten him like a chapstick or something, he probably would have like thrown it at me. So I bought this. I had a 20% a off coupon, I think. Um, they're $7.50 a tube, which I think is kind of crazy for a man's lip balm. Um, but uh, I got it for like 6 something. So... I'm going to put that in a stocking and hope he doesn't throw it at me. Uh, at Walmart, I got a couple more things for a stocking. I got him some candy. I got him the peanut butter M&M's. These are one of his favorites. He loves, he loves peanut butter. So I got him those. I also got him this little uh, Reese's Pieces candy cane. These are only a dollar. I mean, you don't really get much, but um, it's still a cute little stocking stuffer. And then I got him this uh, big bag of Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Miniatures. Uh, I, I wanted a smaller bag of these, but I couldn't find one, so I figured whatever. Uh, between both of us, we'll have this bag consumed before January, so got that. And then the last thing that I got was, well, not the last thing that I got, but the last thing I got at Walmart, I got these Avino um, bath treatments, and these are just like packs of like... <laughs> I'm trying to explain here. Um, basically, they're just like packets of stuff you put in your tub to um, bathe with because it, it um, it's for like dry skin and stuff. And he really likes taking baths. <laughs> and I know that probably like goes against everything I just said about him being manly and hating girly, like pussified stuff, but he, he loves taking baths, which I think is totally okay. Like, I don't think it's really pussified to take a bath. But, um, he had these before and he really liked them. He's downstairs. I don't think he could hear me, but I'm still, like, trying to be a little quiet. Um. But anyway, um, so I got these to, um, just as, like, a last minute type gift because I know who will use them. Um, he also really likes the Big Blue Bath Bombs by Lush, but I didn't place any kind of a Lush order this year, so, um, I, t I couldn't get him any of those, so, those will just have to do. And since it's winter and everyone's skin seems to, like, get dry and itchy, I think that it'll be okay. And then I got him another pair of shoes. Um, between me and my mom, he's gonna get, like, two pairs of shoes. Well, no, three, including the ones that I just got today. But I got these at Kohl's, and the box looks like this. They're snow boots. And they look like this. I really liked them. Um, they're just black with like this neon green stitching. Um, like, he wears a ten and a half in shoes and these are an 11 because he said he'd probably wear a bigger size in boots however I think these look really big so I'm keeping the receipt just in case because I might have to take them back and exchange them for a 10 because I just don't think his foot's this big um but anyway I thought these were really cute they um he doesn't have snow boots um, and, you know, when he goes out to shovel and he's wearing, you know, sneakers and the snow gets in your sneakers and it's just, it's not, it's not good. It's, it's a horrible feeling. 
So I got him these and I think that he'll like them. So then he can wear these and he goes out to shovel because my ass ain't shoveling. But anyway, I have a pair of snow boots. And I thought these were um, nice. They don't, they look like snowboarding boots. You know what I mean? They don't look like, because you know some, some snow boots, especially like the men's boots, they just look really, I don't know, ugly. And these I think just have a little something to them. They look more of like a, a sneaker, like a snow, like a snowboard boot. So I got him those. I think these were, I had another, uh, I had a fit, 20, 15% off. I can't remember. I think it might be 15% off coupon for Kohl's. So these were like 40. So that's not too bad. Um, I love the smell of new shoes. I'm sorry. It makes me weird, but anyway, those are some of the last minute gifts that I have purchased him. Um, I think I am almost done. There's just like a couple of things that I want to get yet. I'm probably going to put some like scratch off tickets in his stocking. And this morning he wanted an egg separator <laughs> because he eats a lot of eggs. Um, but just like the white part. And he was trying to like separate the egg yolks um, this morning when he was making his eggs and complaining because he was using a spoon. But we went to Walmart and, like, couldn't find an egg separator because I thought that was really weird that Walmart d doesn't carry egg separators. So I'm going to look for one of them to throw in a stocking as well because I know he probably totally forgot about wanting one by now because it's just how he is. <laughs> so, anyway, that is my, um, video of some things that, you know, I got him for Christmas. And, um, maybe this will give you guys some ideas of last minute gifts to, like, buy or put in stockings. But anyway, I hope you guys liked the video, and I will see you next time.